first and foremost, like get all praises and glory to Yahweh, 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 Situation happen, situation does happen, and you can't put the blame on you, 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 can't, you, can't, you can't put the blame on no one else. All right, you know what I'm saying? Like, the truth, the truth will make you be a man, and then that's, that's one one thing I noticed when I came, I came this truth. It's just this, this situation, I've been through a couple situations. And guess what? This truth make you be a man, make you stand up uh, as a as a as a person, like as a man though. Cause she 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 hard, she tough, and she will continue to be that way. Cause the Lord purify you, all right. Mm -hmm. So everything ain't gonna be everything ain't gonna be golden. Everything ain't gonna be an easy walk, all right. Mm -hmm. So you, you gotta you, you gotta you gotta take this shit, and you get you got you like you gotta eat it. Alright. I got a pre-sell for you, bro. Uh, this is um Job 33 of Salaki. Job 38 and verse 3. Gird up now your loins mm -hmm. like a man, for I will demand of you and answer you me. Good like curb your loins, man. Man, man, man the fuck up. Alright. Shit hard. Shit will be hard. Shit gonna get hard. But you gotta take it though. You gotta eat that shit, man. Alright? I like, like I said, like I've been it like I said, I've been this truth going ten years. I had two fucking family that passed away. Two. Alright? Now I could have I could I could have been in the world, I could have you know, been in the world and I could like, man, I feel I'm I'm gonna fall back. Like, you know what I'm saying? I could I could have moved way different. I could have done stuff way different, man. But the brother, the brother comforted me, and the brother did videos on the situation. By, especially by my situation, guess what? I, 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 I took it, and I learned it, man. And guess what? We know. I know what my, what, my, uh, what he ate, though. They, they in the spirit where we, they in the spirit where we holler about your shot. Back in, back in the day, I, 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 I wouldn't know that. I'd be like, man, they going to hell. But now since I know this know how the Lord move, how the Lord get down, hey, I'm good. But most people will fall. Most, most people will fall out. Most people like <laughs> a lot of people could get hooked hooked on drugs. Or uh, be, basically be crazy folks, though. Do some crazy stuff. I mean, you, you, got, you got what I'm saying though. Mm -hmm. right. Yeah, Ecclesiastes twelve and seven. There should the dust return to the earth as it was, mm -hmm. and the spirit should return to the Most High who gave it. That's right. See, and, and that's the thing. Death, the people don't understand death. That's the thing about people don't understand death. Because people, people think, because preachers teach you, you're going to go to hell, you're going you're gonna to go to heaven. And people are like, oh, you're going to go to, if you're going to be bad, you're going to send you to hell. No. Everybody go back to the Most High. Everybody. All right? Your body gonna turn to dirt. Guess what? Your spirit go back to your house by your shot. All right. Gotcha. This Hebrews twelve and nine. Furthermore, we have had fathers of our flesh, which corrected us, and we gave them reverence. Should we not much rather be in subjection unto the Father of spirits and live? So that's another title: the Most High Yahweh, Father of spirits. Mm. You know, uh, as it says that we all live unto the Most High, mm -hmm. and even though we so called pass on to, you know, transition to another world. You still live in a spiritual world, mm -hmm. but you have your spiritual bodies prepared for you. Got a precept. This is Matthew nine and eighteen. While he spoke these things unto them, behold, there came a certain ruler and worshipped him, saying, "My daughter is even is even now dead, but come and lay your hand on her, and she shall live." And Yahweh arose and followed him, and so did his disciples. And behold, a woman which was diseased with an issue of blood 12 years, 
came behind him and touched the hem of his garment. For she said within herself, If I may but touch his garment, I shall be whole. But Yahusha turned him about, and when he saw her, he said, Daughter, be of good comfort. Your faith has made you whole, and the woman was made whole from that hour. And when Yahusha came into the ruler's house and saw the minstrels and the people making a noise, he said unto them, Give place, for the maid is not dead, but sleep. And they laughed him you know, to scorn. And, and, and they that man, like her face was so tough. Her face was so tough, it made her whole. Mm -hmm. All right? Mm -hmm. I said, another thing, like you said, he ain't dead. Just sleep. Yeah. And, and it's not, they sleep. Yeah. They ain't really, they, your, spirit, your spirit really don't die. You, you, go, you go back to the most side. Mm -hmm. Energy transfer. That, that's all it is. Yeah. And, and that's, 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 it really is all it is, though. Yeah. You, really, you really don't die. You go back to the most side, and, and guess what? Mm -hmm. And they gonna come back. Yeah. They gonna come back. Go death side. is nothing but Uber. Yeah. You know, death is nothing but Uber from this realm to the spiritual realm. That's how you look at it. It's just mm -hmm. a transference. Yeah. And if I can uh, add, because you said, of course, we don't die, and that's correct. This is uh, 1 Corinthians 15 and 40. There are also celestial bodies mm -hmm. and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. And in the spiritual realm, you have celestial bodies. So there's no need for sleep and to eat or you don't get tired because that body is full of power and energy. So you don't need to eat in the spiritual realm and that's why you have a celestial body. Now on earth, we have what? Terrestrial bodies, right? Which means earthly bodies. So at the end of the day, when a person passes from, from this realm to the next realm, he's just asleep or she's just asleep. But we all go back to the father spirit. Mm -hmm. they, they not struggling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Going through different trials and tribulations. That's what we go through in the flesh in this realm. Mm -hmm. And they'll hold our better position than we are. Mm -hmm. you know? Can I back y'all up? Mm -hmm. This is uh, Luke 23 and 39. And one of the male factors which were hanged railed on him, saying, If you be Mashiach, save yourself and us. But the other answering rebuked him, saying, Do not you fear the Most High, seeing you are in the same condemnation. And we indeed justly, for we receive the due reward of our deeds, but this man has done nothing amiss. And he said unto Yahusha, Lord, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Verse 43. And Yahusha said unto him, Verily I say unto you, Today, Shall you be with me in paradise? Mm -hmm. Go to where paradise it goes to like a state of happiness, mm -hmm. like a light. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna continue, you know, just happiness there. Yeah. You know, and and, 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 that, and that 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 probably a tough scene that that like that, that situation, mm -hmm. like seeing seeing y'all trying to get crucified for no reason, whatever mm -hmm. per se. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and and they got like, man, you ain't done nothing. Yep. So 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 so, and, and y'all trying like, uh. You gonna be me in paradise, right? And that's the, and that's the that's all that's the ultimate goal. It's mm -hmm. coming, yeah. yeah. To, 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 to rain and to, to, to be with your how you how about some shot, man? All right, yeah. That that the difference is all ultimate goal. Have, have, have to have the the bodies and, and to live basically to, to be righteous. Yeah. And so that's the that, so that's the problem. The whole world and wickedness. We we, we just want righteousness. Mm -hmm. All right. Go ahead, bro. Um, so let me and this is Revelation 5 and 5 because we know when Yahweh was crucified, he appeared directly into the spiritual realm. And it's the same process for everybody. If you die tonight, you will appear in the spiritual realm. And to prove that point, this is Revelation 5 and 5. Let me start at verse 4. And I wept much because no man was found worthy to open and to read the book. Neither to look thereon. And one of the elders said unto me, Weep not. Behold, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the root of David, has prevailed to open the book and to loose the seal, the seven seals thereof. And I beheld, and lo, in the midst of the throne 
and of the four beasts and in the midst of the elders stood a lamb as it had been slain, having seven horns and seven eyes, which are the seven spirits of the Most High, sent forth unto all the earth. Meaning, when Yahushua died, he appeared right before the Most High. And that's why the scriptures classify him as looking like a lamb that had been slain, meaning what? He was crucified prior to him going into the spiritual realm. That was his transition. That's how he transitioned from the earthly realm to the spiritual realm. Okay. And, 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 that, and, that's, and that's the thing about it. Like, I mean, like, everybody, everybody gonna, gonna go through situations. Everybody gonna, brother gonna lose them. Jobs, uh, family members, uh, 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 houses, houses, cars, yeah, everything. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, money, you know, anything, bro. Yeah, so so, so we gonna go through nothing. So so you you can't blame nobody about the situation, mm -hmm. and, and 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 lock and lock in the world when Lord take the say you know you know when people die, you know you know what I'm saying, Lord. Why him? They were mm -hmm. like, why? Oh, this wrong person. No, the Lord no. Lord Lord did that for a reason. Mm -hmm. So 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 you can't say you can't question the Lord, basically. You can't question what how the Lord do. How the Lord move at all. So you saw him in in Isaiah, uh, my ways not your ways. Mm -hmm. You know, so I'm saying so you can't question how the Lord move, how the Lord think. They don't work. Mm -hmm. We can't box him. We can't talk to him, really. Well, I'm going I'm to say this. Uh, in, in a humble way, you can question the Most High. Right. And I'm going to say this. The reason why, remember when Abram um, asked, well, Abram became Abraham. But you remember, for the sake of Lot, the Most High was questioning the Most High. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, Abraham yeah. was questioning the Most High yeah, based on the fact that he was yeah. worried about his yeah, nephew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was in a humble fashion. Yeah. But like the brother is saying, Basically, everything has to be done in decent yeah, and in yeah, order. Right. But the reason why we don't question the Most High now because we understand the process of death, that's like right. the brother's saying. Yeah. So we understand. We we understand the mindset of the Most High via the Scriptures and mm -hmm. the Holy Spirit yeah. does something with Come. us. You know. Yeah, you're right. And, 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 like yeah. like people in the world, you know, people in the world would think some told them like like oh, why. Lord wouldn't do that. Why would the Lord do that? Right. The devil you know did. The devil done it. That's right. No. That's right. No. What, what, you got that wrong? Isaiah okay. uh, 55, 89. Right, this is Isaiah 55, verse 8. And it says, For my thoughts are not your mm -hmm. thoughts, mm -hmm. neither are your ways my ways, said the Lord Yahweh. Mm. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways. Mm -hmm. And my thoughts than your thoughts. Well, I mean, look, you can't. <laughs> You can't get around that though. You 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 can't. I mean, he he, t he, t he telling you, he weighs on he weighs on weight higher than our ways. All right. I mean, how, how people. I mean, you know how, you know how people move, how people act. The Lord control everything we do around here, man. How people move. Why why would somebody do that? The Lord made him do that, man. The Lord made him do that. I mean, this is this a movie. Like, we're in a movie. And he can the Lord control everything, man. Yeah, about shy controlling everything. That's right. That's right. All right. This is Deuteronomy 32 and 39. See now that I, even mm -hmm. I, am he. And there is no power with me. I kill. Ooh. And I make a lie. Mm -hmm. I wound. And I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. You can't, you can't do shit. <laughs> when love wants you, when time to go, if you want you to go this way, if you want you to do that, you're going. That's right. That's right. You can't stop it. That's what I said, Romans the ninth chapter, uh, who can resist his will? <laughs> you know? That's right. Hey, you, you, can't, you can't stop moving. He, he got you. That's right. And I'm going to say this, and then for you, for, for, for individuals that have loved ones, and if they're sickly and stuff like that, you don't want them around suffering, especially yeah. if you know the process of death. Because once your uh, family member or so-called loved one makes that transition, hey, they're in peace. 
You know, you can pay them to come to the, uh, back to the earthly realm. Yeah. They're praying for us now. Remember, they got the celestial body. They're in their right mindset. Mm -hmm. You know, and they're grateful to be in the spiritual realm. Yeah, because, uh, hey, they ain't paying no damn bills. That's right. You know, no script like, damn, my car, my car, no, baby. They ain't repo my shit, man. They ain't worried about that, though. Yeah. All right, this uh, Ecclesiastes 30 and 14. Better is the poor being sound and strong of constitution than a rich man that's afflicted in his body. Hey, you got all these riches, but you got cancer. Or you got dementia. Yeah. You know? Or you got an autoimmune disease that is killing you, slowly cooking you. Mm -hmm. And it's best to be poor, but we're not poor because we have this knowledge, which is the true riches. And that constitution is going into that spiritual mindset. Right? Yeah. Verse 15. Health and good estate of body are above all gold, and a strong mm. body above infinite wealth. Yeah, so it, it's best to be poor and broke and have a good the goddamn body, body yeah, right. and to be extremely rich and fucking sickly. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You can't fucking run down oh. the walkway because you got fucking congestive heart failure, or you got kidney disease, yeah. or you're waiting for a heart or a liver transplant. Yeah, man. Hey, that, that, that's that's pretty tricky. Bro. Yeah, we got we got everything we goddamn need. Yeah, cause you got all the money and you can't do nothing. You can't do nothing. You know? Damn, fuck that. And, right. <laughs> I'm gonna have a healthy body and a cool life. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yo. Hey, I got some for you. All day long, bro. Second Corinthians twelve and one. It is not expedient for me, doubtless, to glory. I will come to visions and revelations of the Lord. I knew a man in Mashiach above 14 years ago, whether in the body I cannot tell or whether out of the body I cannot tell. The Most High knows such an one caught up to the third heaven. And I knew such a man whether in the body or out of the body I cannot tell. The Most High knows how that he was caught up into paradise and heard unspeakable words, which is not lawful for a man to utter. And the reason why go ahead. No, 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 it's on you. Go ahead. I like that. I said, like paradise, man. We, 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 we want to be, cause you know, people like paradise, man, like, like, like you, I don't know what like, you, like you free. Yeah, you it's like, like stay, uh, stay, uh, delight. Yeah. Happiness, you know? Yeah, mm -hmm. and, and, and that's, and that's what, that's what's going to happen when Lord come and delivers. Yeah. Especially from, from this, from this bullshit. I mean, take it back to, I, the Lord should come and Lord should Yahweh Shai come take this kingdom and have it set up. It's okay. We're gonna be in paradise. That's right. Like we like we gonna be we gonna be good. Though. It's like like we we have seen what about war gaming? Our people died in the truth and revelation like the most sorrow. And, and, and brother gonna get that though. Yeah. Yeah. And so so like we gonna be we gonna be in paradise, man. Yeah. And that, that that's what we want. All and, right. that, and that priest right there is actually talking about the spiritual realm being no. paradise. Amen. He was called up into the third mm -hmm. heaven. That's the spiritual realm. So when you die or when your loved one dies, like the elder is saying, hey, that's paradise in itself. Uh -huh. You know, hey, hey, what the scripture states, uh, Matthew the sixth chapter, the Lord's Prayer, or is that Matthew the eighth chapter? Six, 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 yeah, six. Matthew the sixth chapter goes into on earth, earth as it is, is in, in heaven. heaven. The heaven, the spiritual realm is a paradise. That's right. And guess what? So what's manifested in earth when Yahweh Shah comes is going to be manifested. Um, what's like it? What's manifested in heaven is mm -hmm. going to be manifested on earth. Ooh. Right? Paradise. 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 When you look up the word paradise in the free dictionary, it says, according to some forms of Christian belief, an intermediate rest in place for righteous souls awaiting the resurrection. Mm. And that's why the scripture tells us that Michael 2 and 10, the part, this is not on rest, rest because it's the age of Esau. But when Yahweh Shah returns, we're going to have the age of Yahweh Shah. Mm. And by default, we're going to have paradise on earth as it is in heaven. Man. Yeah, yeah, we're about nothing, man. Yeah. Oh. Go ahead, bro. Uh, you this want to I just saw uh, Matthew 11 and I'll start at verse um, 27 all things are delivered unto me of my father and no man knoweth the son but the father mm -hmm. neither knoweth any man the father save the son and he to whomsoever the son will reveal him 
come unto me, all you that labor and are heavy laden, mm -hmm. and I will give you rest. Mm -hmm. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and you shall find rest unto your souls. Man, I'm running back, bro. Okay. Matthew 11 and 27. All things are delivered unto me of my Father, and no man knoweth the Son but the Father. Because Yahweh Shai had prevailed in this thing called life. So that's why when you jump to Matthew the 28th chapter, he has received all power, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. he, he's, he's a shot caller now. That's why when mm -hmm. you die, you appear before what? The throne of Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. Just like um, if you watch the Godfather, how the Godfather gave everything to Michael, it's the same thing in the spiritual realm. The only uh, entity that Yahweh Shai answers to is the Most High. Go ahead, bro. Neither nor any man the Father save the Son, and he to whomsoever the Son will reveal him. Right, and the only people or the only individuals that's going to understand the revelation of the Most High through Yahweh Shah is the elect, via the Holy Spirit. Go ahead. Verse 28. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, right. and I will give you rest. Right, because basically, and this rest is actually going into, it starts with this truth first, but then it's going to manifest on earth. Right, go ahead. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, right. for I am meek and lowly in heart, right. and you should find rest unto your souls. And we find rest. That's why we understand even the concept of death. Mm -hmm. Death ain't so scary. We understand what happens when yeah. you perish. That's right, bro. Because Christianity teaches you, like, you so called pass, you're not good. That's right. You're going to hell for eternal. <laughs> like, what type of oh, mercy is that? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to burn up. Burn me with the burning <laughs> yeah. How can you burn a goddamn spirit? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's like putting fire on fire. Yeah. Or putting and fire then, on fire. Yeah. In scripture, go to the most high, he's merciful. How is that merciful to someone you guys, you know, for eternal burning? Forever. Forever? 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 Yep. So, uh, verse 30 For my yoke is easy right. and my burden is light. And this cross is uh, easy, man, because while wow, we have everything we need to maneuver in this thing we call life, right? What revelation would you know, bro? Like, uh, yeah, with the heart. Sorry, I'm tear. Like Revelation 21. Yeah, but you know, I, I want to bring that, like, like you said, how Lord gave everything to Yahweh Shah. I want to bring that out too. Uh, this Psalm 8 and uh, 4. What is man that ought mindful of him in the son of the son of man that shall visit him? For thou had made him a little lower than the angels and crowned him with the glory and honor. Verse 6. Thou have made him to have dominion. The, he, to have dominion. The main mean oh he control everything, all right? Over oh, the works of thy hands that had put all things under his feet. Mm -hmm. So everything you see is under your house, your house, your house shot feet. Yep. Everything. And it's the same thing for us. Mm -hmm. We will because as your house shot standing on the right of the most high, this idea is for the elect in their appropriate order. Right, and a hey, shallow warm to you, Akim, on the comment board. The water for the precepts. Uh, this is the brother, uh, Aina, Memphis, Second Ezra, 10 and 24. And therefore, shake off your great heaviness and put away the multitude of sorrows, that the mighty may be merciful unto you again, and the highest shall give you the rest and ease from your labor. And that's going into that continuing city that we're laboring for, man. You know, are we going to we working for retirement? That's yeah. it. You know, that's what we want through the spirit. Yeah. That's it. Like eternal retirement. Yeah. That's right. Ecclesiasticus forty one and three. Fear not the sentence of death. Remember them that have been before you and that came after. For this is the sentence of the Lord over all flesh. Mm -hmm. So we all go through the process of death, right? We all done died and came back and things of that nature. And Lord will. This, well, I know for a fact, this is the last um, initiation that we will have with death in this mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. Because why? Because right after this kingdom, you have the kingdom of Yahweh Shah. Come. Right? Y'all got something else? Yeah, back up the ties. We're about the dominion. Uh, this is uh, Ecclesiasticus 39 31. They shall rejoice in his commandment, mm. and they shall be ready upon earth when need is. This is going to all the different spirits of vengeance. Yahweh Shah has that type of commandment within the spiritual realm to uh, bring out that type of judgment throughout this earthly realm. They obey his word, you know? So it says, when need is, 
And when their time has come, they should not transgress his word. Right. Therefore, from the beginning, I was resolved and thought upon these things and have left them in writing. All the works of the Lord are good, and he will give every needful thing in due season. You know? Mm -hmm. So Yahweh Shah, he has that type of, mm -hmm. uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, authority within the yeah. spiritual realm by, authorized by the Heavenly Father Yahweh to call out shots throughout this earthly realm. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why I say that uh, he's the author and finisher of our faith. You know? He's yeah. the captain of our salvation, you know? Yeah. And he's mediating for the elect, too. Mm -hmm. So basically, when the Mosah wants to put one of us to death, Yahweh Shah has the ability to negotiate our life. You know, like, look, uh, Pops, this is what's going on, blah, blah, blah. And then as a mediator, the Mosah listens to his son, man. Yep. All right? Uh, That's cool. Yahweh Shah, he negotiating for us. Yeah. <laughs> Spiritual you know? mm -hmm. Are You got something up, bro? I, okay. Revelation 21. Yeah, Revelation. All right, this is Revelation 21. Start at verse 3. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of Yahweh Bashimah Shah is with men, mm -hmm. and he will dwell with them. And this, 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 this thing about me, Lord, deal with me. All right? Man, he, he, you know, he may get women uh, visions, whatever, mm -hmm. say, but the Lord is about me. And then that vision is for the, the man anyway. That's right. You know, you know what I'm saying? So, 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 I'm not trying to shit on the women at all. But we're saying the Lord did with me. Cause if if if, if he if it's all about this is about women, why would I why would the women were part of the the twelve the twelve? Mm -hmm. I mean, right. you know what I'm saying? Right. But even, even we go to the word congregation, it goes into a flock of men. Men, you know. <laughs> you know what I'm but in this life, you know, with uh, dealing with modern Christianity, they think when you see the word congregation, it's talking about anybody, including yeah. yeah, you know. And for you Christians out there, uh, women cannot have a testimony because they don't have nuts. In order to have a, yeah, in order to testify, you have to have balls, man. Testes. Once that term testimony goes into the origin of testes, mm -hmm. right? Yep. And it says, and they should be his people, and the Most High himself should be with them and be their power. And Yahweh Bashim Oshah should wipe away all tears from their eyes. Mm -hmm. But you probably had that son no more pain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be literal in the kingdom of heaven. Yep. And there should be no more death, neither sorrow, mm -hmm. nor crying, neither should there be any more pain. Mm -hmm. For the former things are passed away. That's right. The age of Esau. Yeah. And, and, and we, we won't be. I, people, people won't be dying like, like nowadays, like, you know. Um, Mom, come on, kid get shot at, shot, kid get, child get shot down the street. You know what I'm saying? They're crying by this, crying by that, man. Hey, we we we, we not deal with that no more, man. That's right. Mm -hmm. At all, man. What about somebody getting dying for, for sickness? Um, our brother, brother ain't be hating each other like 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 we do now. All that shit gonna be gone, man. All 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 that, man. It, it's it's. A, Fuck the world, but but you know, right now we gotta deal with it. But when the Lord come back and put us back how things need to be need to be, everybody gonna be good, man. Yeah. Everybody gonna be good. Israelites. Come. Israelites. Yeah. We gonna be good. I mean all, all the, them curses gonna be gone, man. That's it. Then that's the activation of the new covenant. Yeah. That's the activation. Cause yeah. right now, man, right now motherfuckers still hating each other. Still shooting still shooting each other down, man. Mm -hmm. People still fucking dying, man. Still, still fucking dying, man. Still eating bad, fucking bad food, man. Dying of a different goddamn disease, man. Come on. But when the Lord come back, hey, we, we, we gonna be good. Go ahead, bro. This Isaiah 60 and 20. Thy sun should no more go down, neither mm -hmm. should thy moon withdraw itself. For the Lord Yahweh should be thy everlasting light, and the days of thy mourning should be ended. Thy people also should be all righteous. Ooh. So that means that's going into what? The full activation of the new covenant. Mm -hmm. That Holy Spirit is going to be within every Israelite. Right? Yep. They yeah. should inherit the land forever, the branch mm -hmm. of my plants. And the reason why? Because you'll never sin. Mm -hmm. And if you never sin, you'll never die. Yep. Mm -hmm. And make up that, you know, that land, you know, like, we ain't, we ain't in our land. Exactly. <laughs> so, 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 what, so what are we talking about? Yeah, the branch of my planting, the work of my hands, that I may be glorified. Mm -hmm. The branch of his planting. All right, I got one more for you, bro. This is 1 Kings 2 and 1. Now, in the days of David, 
drew near that he should die and he charged Solomon his son saying I go the way of all the earth be you strong therefore and show yourself a man and keep the charge of the Lord Yahweh your power to walk in his ways to keep his statutes and his commandments and his judgments and his testimonies as it is written in the law of Moses that you may prosper in all that you do and whether so ever you turn yourself yeah. So keeping the law, statutes, and the commandments to the best of your ability, that's how you show yourself a man. Mm -hmm. Right? And Lord will, we're part of that first fruit, the true alpha, alpha males of society. You know? But at the end of the day, death is a process. And through the Holy Spirit, through the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the Most High, we know that no one tr truly does. As that parable of going into Yahweh Shah, he traveled into a far country so you can just look at the loved one in a, just a different country yes, that's the power it. we serve he says that we are he's a power to live in not the dead that's right we all live until you how we buy at the end of the day that's it no one ever does yes. just no energy transfer that's it you know uh with that I'm your brother, sister, edified. We like y'all praises and glory to Yahweh 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 it's a taste to your brother, push your word with truth. Truth is a silver four corner. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.